So we have an uncontrolled pelvic bleed here. We could try traditional wound packing, but I want to really highlight the, the effectiveness and the use of the AAJTS. So I'm going to orient this also always towards me. I lead with this edge here, and I'm going to go underneath. So I'm going underneath, and you guys see how this is red to red. I'm going to insert it red to red, just to this red here. I'm going to orient right over the uh, umbilical area, and then I'm going to pull this towards me. That's why I oriented it towards me. So I pull this, kind of like traditional tourniquet, as, you know, high and tight, but here I'm just pulling tight. And now I'm going to use this mechanism to just get it nice and snug. Don't need to go super tight. Now right here, I'm going to inflate until I get to 250 millimeters of mercury. So this is where we're inflating this massive balloon here that will help control this uh, very difficult pelvic bleed. And as I can see here, it's starting to stop the bleed and we're at 250. We can now continue to do further patient care, but this is right now the only device that will control um, a uh, pelvic bleed through the uh, um, basically an aortic uh, tourniquet. So this is a junctional tourniquet, can be used in inguinal areas, aortic, and then obviously in the upper arms as well. So this is the B80 task trainer from Techline, and this is the AAJTS.